Winter is here. Uh, in fact, it's been here since September. And uh, with winter comes a challenge of being outside. So that is why today we are building. Uh, so that is why today. Gee, fuck. Uh, so that is why today we are building a tiny. It's not tiny. A small hovercraft that you can fly slash hover inside. And I'm totally not going to mention that I purposely made so you need the smallest screws in the world. Who is so stupid? Oh wait, that's me. Okay, getting the camera rolling for when it's, I mean, if, if it catches on fire. It's packing a punch. No, no, no. Yikes, that's not good. Simon got a plan though. The following footage is me watching through this FPV screen, through this camera, so I'll get a live view from the hovercraft. If I just planned my videos, these things wouldn't happen. I think the weight distribution, I think the reason why it's so uh, hard to control is because the batteries are way, way back here instead of up here. I, I cannot steer it, god dang. I'm just gonna pass this off as I need some more exercise. My hovercraft is not garbage. Oh, oh. oh I am an actual god. I straight up promoted myself to level 2 as as I clearly mastered level 1. Woo! A 
sadly my skill along with the quality of this footage is horseshit. With no plan, no valuable knowledge on how to design a hovercraft, I took it upon myself and guessed basically every number. I know a lot of you, probably just one, is sitting on the edge of the seat and to know how this wonderful piece of black magic works and how I can build one of these Jesus creations by myself. You see, it's very simple. You'll need two batteries, preferably more, one FPV camera, two motors, two ducted fans, two speed controllers, one receiver, one small servo, transmitter, a charger, then go on Thingiverse and download all the files that I've uploaded. Step three, get the 3D printer. Then build it according to my very clear instructions. That's like saying, here's how you fly a plane. Get in the airplane, know where you want to go, and fly it. The small FPV camera just needs a 5 volt source, so we'll take that from one of the speed controller's BECs. Instead of connecting one battery to one speed controller, we are simply connecting both batteries to both speed controllers. Very nifty. That way both batteries are emptied out equally. The black skirt material is nothing fancy, just a plastic bag, the thinner the better. Now back to more driving. It's been a couple of days, I, I've decomposed, I mean decompressed, and I've analyzed the information, I, what I've learned, and I feel ready to crash, I mean show you my unbelievable skill. Top speed is not too bad. Yeah. Oh, I broke the servo. Now it's dying on me. Oh no, put it out of its misery. Concussive blows to a servo is not a good idea. Who knew? Lithophanes are pictures that literally appear wherever there is light. Go to arslifeonsimon.com, upload your photo, and I will 3D print your lithophane and send it out to you. Thank you very much for watching, and have a very happy Christmas.